Hi everyone and welcome to the video. In this video, I'm going to be talking about how to transfer images uh, using Python from a server to client. So what are we trying to establish here is whenever a client makes a request to the server and say, hey, or whatever messages you send, the server will send an image to the client. So let's look. Interesting how to transfer images in Python. Convert it. So the basic algorithm is basically convert into a binary image, convert the image into binary, send it, byte, uh, send it in... Uh, Bits of data 1024, that is the buffer length. So let's look at the beautiful code here. And as usual, the code is there in the description on my GitHub account. Please download it. It's a nice user interface that I have developed. So let's see that in action. So this is server software. You log in using admin, admin. All right, we are logged in admin, admin on the client software. So press the connect button and here it says on the user interface, waiting for connection. All right. So whenever I send any messages like, hey, what's up? So if I send that, I get this huge amount of text. That is nothing but my binary text. And if you see here, received file.png, that is my image was transferred from my server. Let me quickly open that and show you. So, so here you see a beautiful photo of the image that was been trans that was being sent through the server via Python. So let's look at the, let's look at the code logic. Um, pretty simple, not too complicated, of course. Just the user interface. Um, so don't worry about that. So the main code is about the server. Uh, let me just find that real quick. I have a long code. Yep, here it is. So the way uh, I, I, I did, did this software is basically, this is the logic, okay? This just this part. Open the image, convert the image into binary, read the image as binary, and uh, re read the buffer size is 1024, while L, that is when, while the buffer is true. Send that uh, data, then again read that data, and again the read the new chunk of data, that is 1024. Then this, what this guy will do, is again to read the data and again while l if, if it, this is true if this is true okay <coughs> i'm just i'm sorry about that so if this is true keep sending the data only uh, until the entire data is sent so if you look at the client side the logic to receive the data at the client side all right where is my code yep yep there we go so basically uh, what I'm trying to do here is uh, with socket, that socket is creating a socket, a TCP IP. Not always basic. I'm not up going to discuss that. So here is a logic. With open receipt file.png, write buffer. So read uh, write as binary, as a file. And um, what I'm trying to do is while true data equals to receive 1024. So receive 10 first 124 bits, byte, sorry, of data. And, um, you know, just printing the mess message saying that, yeah, I'm getting the data. If not data, that means if the data is not there, that means the entire data has already been received. Break, break the while loop, else f.write data. So write the data into that file. Again, it goes up while true. Hey, is it true? Oh yeah, it's true. I'm getting data. Okay. So receive one, again, next 124 bits of data. And this will keep on going on until the entire data has been uh, sent from the server so i hope you guys enjoy this video and if so give a like and as usual the code is there in the description section below i would prefer you uh typing the code rather than just copy and pasting it so in this way you will learn something new so that's it guys thank you so much and see you guys next time if you have question post a question in the comment section below and i will try my best to get back to you as soon as possible that's it for this video and see you guys next time